Okay, today I'm going to be showing you how to administer a cleansing enema. So the physician ordered a 100 milliliter soap sun enema. So I went ahead and filled up my bag with water and I primed my tube. So we're going to raise the bed up to a working height. I'm going to put my gloves on. We're going to put the soap in it. Make sure the water temperature is 105 to 110 degrees Fahrenheit. Okay, so once that all is all mixed up, put that back up there. Okay, so now that the bed is at working height, I'm gonna lower the bed rail. We're gonna put the patient onto his left side. Okay, I'm going to walk into the room, introduce myself, and explain to the client what I'm gonna be doing. So I'm gonna be performing a soap for enema today. I'm gonna to start by raising the bed to a working height. Okay. Put our waterproof pad on underneath it. I'm gonna put on my soap I'm going to position the patient on their left gonna side. We're going to take this, take the end off of it, and then we're going to lube it up, put some extra lubing on the end of it. And we're going to insert it three to four inches into the rectum. 1,000 milliliters for a soap sense enema, and it's 105 to 110 degrees. So then, once that's in there, three to four inches, we're going to start it at the hip. We're going to unclamp it, and as the patient tolerates it, we're going to raise it up and put it up on this. And if they have any cramping or start complaining, we can take it off and start lowering it back down by the hip and clamp it off again. And then once they're ready, you can unclamp it and start raising it back up again. And then you want to make sure to check on your patient, tell them to deep breathe, and make sure that they're retaining all the water. And solution that they can. So once you're done, you're going to take this out, clean all your supplies. I'm going to clean up the bottom, remove this pad, and make sure they either have a bedpan or a bedside commode nearby. Roll it back on the side. Lubricate it some more. I'm going to insert it into the check on them. Just try to get them to retain as much yeah, solution as you can. Um, and if they are retaining that well, I'll put the bed roll back up. Move it up. And so I'm ready to change. And make sure that the cold light is in within we'll reach. Hang it on and then. Dispose and of then all of the cramps, materials. Down, so I can go back 